Hey guys, I'm Daniel Springs. Okay, today I've got an all new review on a new product. It's called Big Steam Stones. Okay, these steam stones, um, they're an alternative to the shisha or the, uh, the, <laughs> the uh, herbal molasses. And um, basically what this is, is just a, a stone that's been saturated with molasses. And as it heats up, it puts off like a water vapor, kind of like the electric cigarettes. All right. Um, the water vapor kind of looks like uh, just smoke. Um, with this product, basically it's been designed to be like a healthier alternative to smoking as opposed to the tobacco with the nicotine in it. This stuff does not have nicotine in it. You're not gonna get a nicotine buzz, but the product itself is very wet, it's very highly saturated with molasses. Today's flavor is Big Steam Stones Mint. And uh, this mint isn't like other mints that I've, I've had before. This one's more of a spearmint. So it's more of kind of like a bubblegum spearmint or spearmint. And uh, the smell that you get off of it, it's just a really good spearmint, uh, minty smell. Um, smoking it is kind of like smoking a menthol cigarette. It has a nice cooling effect as it goes down into the lungs. Puts off great amounts of, I don't know if it's smoke or if it's water vapor. I've been told that it's water vapor been told that it's smoke and it puts off a big cloud of whatever it is but uh the best way i find to smoke the steam stones is in a vortex bowl because these are highly saturated with molasses and uh, you don't want the molasses to get sucked down into the base of the the hookah you want to kind of let the molasses and the the steam stones just sit there and get heated evenly and uh, with this product, you can throw tons of charcoal on there. You can load up this bowl with like a pound of charcoal and it's never gonna get harsh as opposed to tobacco or the herbal shisha, the, uh, the, just the herbal molasses blend. Um, this stuff is really good though. Um, it's a really good flavor. It's not like too minty. It's not like a really heavy mint. Uh, you do get a bit of a cooling sensation going down, kind of like a menthol cigarette. Uh, but like I said, um, it's really not that strong. It's a nice mellow mint flavor. Uh, the thing with mint though, is that every mint that I've ever smoked, you need to clean your hookah immediately after you get done smoking and everything cools down because it's really hard to get a mint flavor out of a hookah. I mean, you can smoke mint, and then the next flavor that you smoke is going to have a mint flavor with it. Uh, so be sure that you clean your hookah immediately after you smoke mint. Um, if you're a mint fan, I'd say go ahead and check this product out. Like I said, it's called Big Steam Stones. You can pick it up at www.smokinghookah.com. Link in the description below. Um, like I said, Vortex Bowl, best way to use this stuff. Um, any kind of bowl like that. I'm sure if you got a funnel bowl, a funnel bowl would work great too. I don't have one. I've never used one. Uh, I understand that they work under sort of the same concept as a vortex bowl. You're not sucking straight through the bowl. You're kind of, you kind of have a little bit of an area for the molasses and your shisha to sit. This stuff, that's basically how it works is off the molasses, not the stone itself. The stone, it uh, kind of looks like the, the gravel that you put in your fish tank. <clears throat> but you do get the flavor out of it. It's good. Uh, I recommend this for newbies, like new hookah smokers, people that aren't used to shisha, people that aren't used to setting up hookahs, because this stuff, you can't go wrong with setting it up. You can throw as much charcoal as you want on there. You can get as thick of a smoke out of it or as thick of a cloud out of it as you want. And there's no way to burn the shisha like you can with just a regular tobacco shisha or an herbal shisha. It does not burn. Throw tons of char charcoal on there and you'll be set. I mean, like you could play with it and figure out how to, how to set up a hookah if you're a newbie. It'd be great for that.
Also, this would be a great uh, mint flavor for a newbie. It's not an overwhelming mint flavor. It's a very subtle mint. It's kind of like a toothpaste flavor, like the mint that you get out of that, a spearmint out of your toothpaste. Okay, there's no buzz, lots of molasses, easy to use, easy to set up. Um, basically, I mean, like, it's a really wet product. It can be a bit messy, but it has this awesome container. It's got a screw type lid, so you know, like, your shishas, or not your shisha, but your uh, steam stones are gonna be in there and they're not gonna fall out. Um, but yeah, like I said, this is Big Steam Stones, and this is mint flavor. You can go check this out at www.smokinghookah.com. Uh, I just want to thank them for making this video possible as well. Uh, you can follow me here on YouTube. If you guys want to subscribe, that'd be great. Comment below. Uh, I'm going to be leaving a link in the description for www.smokinghookah.com, as well as I'm going to leave a link to... Uh, my blog so you can follow me there you can also follow me on Facebook again I'm Daniel Springs this was Big Steam Stones Mint Flavor thanks for watching